Hi everyone, this is Akil from Grid3D and today I'm going to show you the changes and alteration which we have made in the Unlimited and the Gripper Thumb. Basically we have made three changes. First is the Gripper Palm and the second is the Forearm and the Cuff. So first I'm going to show you the changes we made in the Gripper Palm. The Gripper Palm is basically the gripper palm is basically uh, designed from skip meats so the, it used to work with the rubber awning which we replaced with the torreson spring so the modification which we made in the gripper palm is that first we made a groove in the finger in the thumb and uh, it, it used to have a cable tie like this and the o-ring uh, was used to be attached with this so we modified the thumb which you can see over here and as well as the palm so first we insert the thumb over here and then we use this spring so you can see is it has a three turn is it is a three turn spring and we insert it over here and with this pin, it's a, a steel a pin, you can see, 4 mm in diameter. And you insert it over here and this is how it works. So this was the alteration in the thumb. We are in the grip of uh, thumb and we also modified the back of it. So this is a printed in one piece and you can see the plug over here it has it has been modified uh, from the original one we have made these grooves uh, uh, to to attach our forearm so now we come here now let's come towards the forearm so this forearm is uh, uh, is taken from the uh, unlimited uh, arm and we uh, and we customized it so you can see that the uh, the, uh, these slots, these things have been modified for the purpose of the attaching this gripper thumb. So and so this is how it attach. It is attached to the uh, gripper thumb, and then with these nuts and bolts, it is locked together. Now, in the in the forearm. We have also eliminated the need of thermoforming it to form a 90 degree to the cuff. So why do we made the hybrid of an unlimited and the gripper? We did this because uh, in uh, unlimited uh, forearm, uh, in the arm, you have to uh, have the flex uh, movement in order to hold any, uh, uh, anything you want. But in the gripper thumb, you can hold anything like, for example, this glass without any extra effort and you have to just hold it once. So, so I was saying that first we have eliminated the need of thermoforming it to form the 90 degrees with the cuff. Now, coming towards the cuff, cuff is same as the unlimited one but we have eliminated those tensioner blocks because we don't need the fish, uh, fishing lines for this we also eliminated the the pins the pna pins because we have re and we have replaced it with the with the nuts and bolts so the pins the pna pins used to wear and tear a lot in harsh conditions in uh, high temperatures so we replaced it with that uh, and this is and we have made the grooves for the nuts and bolts so now coming towards the material which is used for the for the printing palm and the thumb is printed in abs it can also be printed in pad g which is not recommended but pla is strictly not recommended because it uh, in high temperatures, it, it, it wears off a lot and it breaks. So, ABS is recommended. 
and because ABS is also good because you can have a good finish when you paint it it is painted in deco paint it's usually how cars are painted because it gives good texture as you can see and aesthetically it looks good so we have also served the cosmetic purposes for the gripper palm now coming towards the forearm and the cuff the forearm and the cuff are printed in a, a PLA and because it's thermoformable and it's a color fab material uh, in, and skin tone too so you can see that it's a skin tone it does not require any coloring and it's easily thermoformable and very um, uh, cosmetically pleasing so the end product if I show you the end product this is the end product now you can see the gripper palm and how it works you hold a glass and you just put push it with the other hand and you see it holds it now you don't need to apply an extra effort to uh, hold it uh, for a time you can hold it for an hour you won't get tired so and you can move easily as you can see you can drink water with it and so this is the end product you see the forearm the palm and the cuff and this is all from my side. Thank you.